Hello, Cosmic Hunters. Welcome to Cosmic Hunt X, the channel where we hunt for the secrets of the universe and share them with you. Today, we're going to tell you a story that might sound like a crazy idea, but some people have actually wondered about it. What would happen if we dumped our trash into volcanoes? Imagine a world where we have no more landfills, no more garbage trucks, no more recycling bins. Instead, we have a simple solution for all our waste problems. Just throw it into a volcano and watch it burn. Sounds easy, right? Well, not so fast. There are many reasons why this idea is not only impractical, but also dangerous and harmful for our planet. Let us explain why. The first thing we need to consider is how much trash we're talking about. According to the latest statistics from the U.S. Environmental Protection Agency, EPA, are from 2020. The EPA estimates that Americans generated 292.4 million tons of trash in 2020, which is about 5.2 pounds per person per day. Globally, the world generated 2.014 billion tons of municipal solid waste in 2020, with an average of 0.75 kilograms per person per day. And these numbers are expected to increase in the future, as population growth, urbanization, and economic development drive up consumption and waste production. Now, do you know how many volcanoes we have on Earth? There are different types of volcanoes, depending on how they erupt and what kind of lava they produce. The ones that we're interested in are called shield volcanoes, which are usually found in places like Hawaii and Iceland. These volcanoes have gentle slopes and produce runny lava that forms lakes or rivers on their surface. These lava lakes might look like giant pools of fire, but they're actually very viscous and dense, meaning that anything that falls into them will not sink, but float on top. There are only about 150 active shield volcanoes on Earth 3, and most of them are not located anywhere near humans, for obvious reasons. That means that getting all our trash to an active volcano would be very expensive and difficult, not to mention risky. But let's say we somehow manage to transport our trash to a volcano and start dumping it inside. What would happen then? Well, nothing good. We can tell you that. The trash would act as a cold and solid barrier that would disrupt the flow of lava and create pressure underneath. This pressure would eventually cause steam explosions that would send lava and trash flying into the air. These explosions could be very dangerous for anyone nearby, as well as damaging to the environment. But even if we could somehow avoid these explosions, we would still have to deal with the pollution that burning trash would create. Most of our trash is made of materials that do not decompose easily such as plastic, metal and glass. When these materials are exposed to high temperatures, they release toxic gases and particles that would pollute the air and the surrounding land. These pollutants could harm the health of humans and animals, as well as contribute to global warming and climate change. So, as you can see, dumping our trash into volcanoes is not a good idea at all. It would be costly, dangerous and harmful for our planet. Instead of looking for ways to get rid of our trash, we should look for ways to reduce it. We can do this by following the three R's. Reduce reuse and recycle. By reducing our consumption of unnecessary items, reusing what we can and recycling what we can't, we can minimize our waste production and save precious resources. That's the end of our story for today. We hope you learned something new and enjoyed listening to it. If you did, please leave us a comment below and let us know what you think. And if you have any questions or suggestions for future topics, feel free to share them with us as well. Thank you for watching Cosmic Hundex, and until next time, keep hunting for the secrets of the universe.